Awkward Mafia. Hello, Hello internet. internet! Welcome to another episode of Awkward Mafia Watches Lost. I'm Jesse. I'm Christine. Today we are watching Season 2, Episode 10, 23rd Psalm. It's a Bible verse. Bible thing. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what the difference between a verse and a psalm is, because I'm not very religious, but I've heard both of these things. <laughs> uh... Psalms are songs, tech, I think, technically. Like, they were okay. songs, and then they were they were just, they were put in a book. Okay. I think. Now that sounds, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty right, sure. But yeah, correct us, because we're, we're heathens. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, I, I used to be religious, but, like, I never really, they didn't really clarify that. I just think. Because they know really, the answer. Why would they need to talk about it? <laughs> but I'm pretty sure Psalms are songs. Yeah. Okay. They sound similar, so I'm I'm willing to believe that. <laughs> I don't remember what the twenty third psalm is though. Yeah. Something about I don't Jesus. know. Jesus. <laughs> Presumably. <laughs> Actually I think Psalms is in the Old Testament. Oh, uh, okay. Hey, we just talked about the Old Testament. Yeah. Last time or previously. Previously on Lost. <laughs> yeah, you keep getting it previously wrong. on Lost. There you go. Uh some stuff with Kate. We found out what she did, but more importantly, uh Old Testament. <laughs> we we learned how the Old Testament was found in yeah. real life. <laughs> and they also found a missing piece of film connected to the other the orientation film. Mm-hmm. And it didn't really give them that much more information. And I know, it's like, okay, we, we can't... They just reiterated, don't do anything other than put in the code. Yeah. Or else another incident might happen, or... Yeah, and uh, as soon as they do, my, what does Michael do? <laughs> literally use it for something else. He wasn't in the room, so maybe he didn't hear it. But no, he was. Or, no, no, he was outside, but he can he can hear from where he was. No, I mean like he did watch the film though. The, yes, but not with but with the, the part where oh yeah no communication yeah cut out. So he has a little bit of plausible deniability. But also, <laughs> yeah, Michael isn't as you know religious and yeah. Sure, and also it's his son. Well, he didn't know that until you know. Yeah, but also it's but also just like Michael. Hey, maybe someone outside the island is yeah, communicating yeah. with us. Yeah, I mean, I get it. I I get it. He was curious. I would be curious too. Honestly, like, I probably would have done that same thing. <laughs> I probably would have said hello too. It's like, wait, hello. Like, are you an AI? Are you, yeah, right. Like, are you someone off the island? Who- well, I think the main thing is like, um, like they tell you not to don't use it for anything else. But I think the main thing was like. Uh, when Locke tried to enter the code beforehand, yeah, the computer, nothing happened. It like it was just you couldn't. It, it doesn't work outside of the four minutes before count. Yeah, so it was like you could argue that like it can't even do anything other than like he the code. He, he just went. Yeah, doesn't do anything. But it just. But when Michael did it, it worked. Yeah. Well, I guess they didn't try pressing, you know, letters, but like. I don't, I don't know. You, I mean, that's true they could have just been hitting numbers yeah so but it's i mean if if like this computer is like yeah saying hello like i i probably would have said hello. <laughs> i don't blame him would you like to play a game oh, oh no no and oh no <laughs> no bye <laughs> okay thanks bye <laughs> lol <laughs> <laughs> what <laughs> he doesn't know what it means uh all right well Let's jump into the 23rd Psalm. But first, you at home, this is not a market substitute. Please support the official release. Let's watch Lost. The plane was loaded with heroin. As neither of us are addicted, we should be fine with his knowledge. (laughs) Right, Charlie? (laughs) Yes. (laughs) (laughs) I mean, they don't know. know. The only person who knows is Locke, right? And Jack. Oh, Jack knows now? Uh, yeah, because uh, in the episode of The Moth, Jack figured out he was going through withdrawal. Oh, right. right. And he told Claire. Right. And he told Hurley. That's it. <laughs> I forget who knows things anymore. I man. know. We're two, we're two seasons in. It gets a little mixy. Mixed up. So whose flashback do you think this is? Well, nah. I was going to say the, the actual actor's name, Mr. Echo. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Adewale. <laughs> My bad. 
What's your name, boy? Echo. Look at Mr. Echo. <laughs> no hesitation. <laughs> A born killer. <laughs> Come. You won't need that anymore. Back. Make we go, make we go. Rough childhood. <laughs> Moses had great difficulty speaking. So it was Aaron who spoke for him. Yeah, he is. Moses had like a lisp, I think, or a stutter. Hmm. Fun fact. <laughs> he doesn't want to admit he's religious, but he carries around a statue of the Virgin Mary. Oh. Statue? Yeah. He says he found it on the island. Weird, right? Mm. Where in the jungle? I don't know. Where? Look, what are you... It's just a statue. Just a statue. He's like, no. <laughs> How did he know? Where's Johnny? I mean... Probably worked for drug traffickers. <laughs> mm. As a child soldier. Hmm... <laughs> I used to love those old silent movies where the robbers would crack a combination lock with their ear pressed up against the safe. And the money they stole was always in a white bag with a big dollar sign on it. <laughs> silent movies, huh? You're not that old, man. I'm old enough. <laughs> <laughs> with the new folks joining us, I figure we better limit people's access to the guns. Can't have just anyone who wants one walk in and help themselves. Which I'm guessing is why you're here, Michael. That's terrifying. <laughs> Come right Where towards did you. you find what happened? Where did you find it? In the jungle. I found it in the jungle. Take me there. Where you at? This is not your business. I want you to take me to where you found it. Okay, fine. Yeah, we'll go for a stroll. We're going now. Okay. Let me go tell class. I should have the wrong idea. Wait here. They're on the way. Is what I will pay you in exchange for the favor you're asking me to do. A favor? You have a large quantity of heroin in a country that has no puppies and no market for its sale. Your drugs are of no value here, so you must get them out. The borders are all guarded by the military. The only private planes currently allowed into the air are either UN aid or the Catholic missionaries. And so you have come to me for a favor. I will buy your heroin. It is true what they say about you. And what is that? <laughs> you have no soul. <laughs> no. Go and tell your friends I let you live. Have Mr. Echo let you live. Yeah! Two thirds at once. <laughs> What's this? Because this was in your little statue. And unless I'm mistaken, I seem to remember you saying you were a drug addict. I don't know. Look, if it's sealed up inside a statue, how would I know? Bravo. <laughs> All right. Well, we're here. Find it right here, my belly tree. You did not find the statue here. Take me to the plane. The 
plane. How does he know the plane? How do you know about the plane, man? <laughs> well, then. I'm so... I can't. I can't. <laughs> you want me to take you to your plane? You better start treating me with some respect. I'm not just some guy you can just tra Oh, yeah, the monster. What? Let's go. <laughs> He's never seen it before. Yeah, because they weren't really dealing with the monster. They were dealing with the... The others. The others, yeah. Wow, that was great. And hey, if you enjoyed it, be sure to support us on Patreon. Yes, we have a Patreon now. Yay. We got three tiers. One dollar, five dollar, ten dollar. Each one's better than the last and you get everything from the previous. So don't forget to check it out. There's a link in the description and a square at the end of the video will be around here somewhere. Uh, so thanks for watching and stay tuned because this video's not over, obviously. <laughs> what are you doing here? Oh. I've come to give my confession. Hello, Echo. Hello, brother. The little guy he saved. For confession to mean something, you must have a penitent heart. You and your guilt, Yemi. I've only done what I needed you to do to survive. How is that to see? You may live far from here, but that doesn't mean I haven't heard of who you are and what you have done. Have you forgotten how you got that cross, brother? The day they took me? Is what I did that day a sin? Or is it forgiven? Because it is you that was saved. Morality's hard, guys. <laughs> I've come to help you. I have some merchandise that I need to get out of the country. I would like to use one of your church relief flights to transport it. Merchandise? You mean drugs? We are moving the drugs out of Nigeria so that they cannot be used by our people. And the money. You have all the money to buy your vaccine. God has given us this opportunity. We should not turn our back on it. God did not bring you here, Echo. Your own greed did. You know, you don't have to be belligerent just for belligerent's <laughs> sake. Everyone loves you now. Oh, Pucky. Yo, Sawyer. Glad you're back, man. Glad you're okay, man. <laughs> Kate's like, mm. <laughs> See? Don't even say it. <laughs> A priest? You know that guy? This man saved my life. No. Saved your life, huh? Sure. <laughs> makes sense. Like, what the heck happened? He takes off in a plane in Nigeria. We're out in the middle of the South Pacific. That makes all the sense in the world. <laughs> Just shh, shh. <laughs> He's trying to say a prayer, man. <laughs> you're a priest. You're a priest, right? He's a priest and you're a priest too, right? Oh. <laughs> Not exactly. Applying drugs under the cover of the church. How's that something I could ever reconsider? <laughs> hey, don't touch those. I'm going to make this easy for you. You will make us priests and we will fly the drugs out ourselves. Make you priests? Just sign these ordination documents and I will give you the money for the vaccines. I am your brother and I would never do anything to hurt you. But my friends, if you do not do what I ask, they will burn this church to the ground. My signature does not make you a priest, Echo. You could never be a priest. How many of the statues do you have left? The Virgin Mary statues, how many? I have uh, 300. I will take all of them. I guess we are both sinners now. Perhaps we are. But oh, God will forgive me. Echo. So technically he's a priest. <laughs> he, On paper. He has the legal documents to prove it. Yeah. I mean, in a way, he's now more of a priest. Yeah. <laughs> Lost.